Hi guys! So today we are going to unbox uh, a few makeup yang I beli online. So we will be unboxing from Focalor, Shopee and also Muka and Co. These are the two parcels. It's really kecil je lah. Tak lah besar mana kan. Tak banyak pun. And it's really cheap. So Muka and Co had like clearing sale. I'm not sure why. I think they want to like much uh, revamp their business or something like that. So they were clearing out their items. And this was actually suggested by Husna. So thank you Husna. I'm going to try this. And then this one, I dah beli lama. I just wanted to do uh, do it together with Muka & Co. So I simpan. I tak buka-buka lagi. This one, I beli dekat Shopee. The Focalor brand. I usually buy um, for my eyebrow. My eyebrow products, I buy from Focalor because it's really cheap. Anyway, so... Uh, I bought eyebrow pencil and then dalam ni kita ada tinted tinted I tak tahu tinted apa I lupa lah I beli apa sebenarnya but yang I tahu if I'm not mistaken dia ada uh, beauty blender ada the tinted serum ke tinted moisturizer ke I tak tahu but it's tinted Okay, the first time I do it, I nak pakai yang tinted-tinted ni benda ni is usually I akan pakai just either just concealer and powder or foundation terus Let's open this mukaandco.com Stay home, stay glow. Mm. So this is how the packaging looks like. Okay. It's just yang macam normal paper bag tu. Chomela. Mm. Alright, so one beauty blender. Uh, and actually, I ada baru je beli beauty blender dekat Shopee. I bought it for wiring gate something je. This one is the one I bought from Shopee. Okay. This one is the one that comes with the bundle from Muka & Co. Let me just... Let me just... Just sama je. Alah, it's a sponge lah. I rasa sama je. I usually don't buy expensive sponges because... There's something that you have to change always because hygiene purposes, kan? So, it collects bacteria. So, you have to change your sponges always. This is what's inside. Muka and Co. Yeah, so, one tint glow serum mineral-based chemical-free and the other one is velvet tint mineral-based weightless creamy matte. I'm excited! So, this is how the packaging looks like. Okay, now we're going to open the second package. Okay, so memang I selalu lah beli dengan Fakular. So, their packaging is usually like this. If you buy from the mall punya shop. Wow. I forgot I bought this. I beli bronzer. Okay, story about bronzer. I use a lot of bronzer because I could never find the right shade for my skin tone. It's usually either too dark or too light but selalunya it's too light. Even if I get like suggestions from store assistant that's too. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Right, so kita continue balik. So dekat dalam package yang I beli from Shopee, I ada this one. This one is highlight and contour. Okay, and then I beli eyebrow pencil. Ada ada four different types of eyebrow pencil. Actually, there's five, but yang tu I dah buka because I sebenarnya nak cancel, patut I terbeli, and I tak realise sampai benda dah sampai. Baru I tahu cakap, oh, I dah beli, I dah beli lagi satu yang asing. Yang sepatutnya I nak cancel, tapi I dah beli, dah tersampai. So, I buy shipping dua kali, by the way. This one is the Stage... Stage Genius. Stage Genius. Stage Genius? Stage Genius. Super Fine Eyebrow Pencil. Okay, I had a dual coat dekat sini. T02 Dark Brown and T04 Grey Brown. Okay, so this is how the... Uma. Okay, so this is how the packaging looks like. It's really cute. I love rose gold. Okay, super cute. And then we have this one. This one is the cheaper ones. I think this was only like two ringgit, three ringgit. Look, this guy's name Pink Flash. Pink Flash is not a different brand. It's a different brand. Is it under for color? I'm not sure. So it's Pink Flash, and this one shade dia satu at least shade. 
zero two, but the other one tak ada pun tulis, so I tak tahu lah. Looks different. I'm gonna open all. This is like unboxing, pas tu like first time I try benda benda ni. So before we do anything, I'm just gonna clip my hair. We look a clip. Come change the first I akan moisturize my my face pakai uh, rose skin ni I tutup belah bawah ni sebab dia ada yang macam glue tu is no I beli yang dual pack lepas tu the, the sticker yang stick uh, the product together tu is really 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 macam glue macam lekit-lekit so dia punya residue pun Tu lagi. I don't so I am going to moisturize my face first. Okay, it's gonna take a bit. I'm really dry, by the way. My skin type is dry, so I'm just. Mm. Mm. Applying the product to my face. It is a bit thick, tapi sebab I tak ada keluar jalan mana mana pun, so I okay je. I am looking for water based punya. Moisturize this, but nation ni kan panas. Even though I punya skin dry, tapi kalau I perlu, I still macam secret oil sikit. So this is a bit too thick. If I pakai keluar jalan like, it gets oily. So I don't like that. So I'm looking for like water based new moisturizers. So do comment down below if you guys ada suggestion for good water based moisturizers because there are so many. Uh, oh, affordable, affordable. Uh, water based moisturizer Ah, tu penting Affordable tu penting Ya yeah? Sebab kita kan sekejap lagi Okay Duit kita limited sikit lah Oh Kenapa buka ni So first of all I'm going to try this This one The Tinted Serum Tint Glow Serum Mineral Based Chemical Free Dia ada SPF 35 My skin character is very basic Cleanser Moisturizer Dan Dan tak lah Banyak-banyak Plus I I don't have the discipline untuk buat skin care review. Tapi I tahu I patut ada lah kan. Skin baru lah cantik kan skin. I got the shade medium glow. Ya tu. Ooh, I love the packaging. Take a look at that. Cantik. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Love it. It's a pump cube. See? It's a cube. It's a pump cube. It's really nice. I'm gonna shake it. I'm gonna square it a bit. Yeah. Alright, so this is how it looks like on my hand. Okay. I don't know how I left up. I put a makeup pouch. It's been a while. It's been a while, guys, since I last put on makeup. I think it's a bit too dark. The shade for me. Oh, shake. Oh. Mm. Let's try it. Mm. Uh. Mm. I don't know. Mm. Okay, pula. It's a bit, it's a bit too dark for me. But, tak apa. Sebab, I banyak aja benda yang lagi lighter shade daripada my skin color so I am just going to conceal blend it lagi nampak macam tak dark sangat. I don't know what to feel about this shade. Tapi dia tak rasa macam ada product pun kat muka I. Is it too dark? Or is it okay? I'm going to go and basahkan this beauty blender so be right back okay so i am back now the beauty blender is wet and as you can see the original size was this big and they dah increase in size and it's more squishier than before oh love it right kita try the super tan uh tint serum the cut muka eye i feel like i love the texture it's just the shade oh I'm just gonna take the ones from my yang I dah swatch kat tangan ni sebab pembaziran I'm just gonna apply it on my face and red doll and then the shade I'm not sure if there are a specific name for the shades but there are the three shades it's fair, 
medium and tan or dark I'm not sure so the one I took is medium and I obviously took it all the wrong shade <sighs> I'm gonna try to let's see if they cover my upper acne scars I honestly don't know guys this shade does it look tan ke tak? Kejap dia nampak okay, kejap dia nampak gelap air Tak faham, definitely Sudah Ini Ini muka air Kita go to the floor juga, okay? Sebab lah apa nak jadi, ya dulu I am just gonna dab 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 Oh yeah, my powder My powder shade pun is light Lighter than my skin Oh, this is so dark. <laughs> Ooh, I look hurt. Okay, okay. Should have done my eyebrows first. Usually, I buy eyebrows dulu. Ni lah masalah bila dah lama tak buat makeup. You just forget the sequence. There's actually no right in the sequence pun. It's up to you lah. But I usually like the pattern of the brows first. Hmm. Too dark. Too dark. Definitely too dark. <sighs> it's okay. It's okay. And it does not cover the scars. But it's okay. It's a tinted, it's not foundation So, tak boleh expect dia to cover So, this is my lighter shade concealer This is the concealer Yang orang suggest dekat I Yang orang usually I tak tahu lah I dengan shade ni memang tak ngam So, we will just conceal Banyak sikit Sebab done my eyebrows first I, I usually just put dot dot je concealer ni but since this shade is pretty dark I'm doing this oh better way better this looks slightly better let's try to put on powder I'm taking my light shade powder. Kalau base dia tak ada yang tu nak ngam. So this is light. So I'm just gonna use this all over my face. Oh, I think it's gonna be okay, guys. Okay. A tan girl. She a little tan. Ooh, I don't know if I like how this is looking. I'm just gonna pin my hair back. This is getting in the way, honey. So now I'm gonna use the highlight and contour that I got from Shopee. Procolopernia brand. Ooh, cute. Look at that. I love the packaging lah. Bling for colors. Okay, this is how the inside looks like. Okay. This one I got in the code 1. I got in the code 1. Dia ada plastik dekat mirror dia Oh, satisfying Okay So, I'm going to use this brush This is the brush that I use to bronze Dulu, I pakai ni This one is uh, medium bronze I think this was Catrice kot This one, Catrice Medium bronze Sebab dah habis Lepas tu, bila dia dah Saat-saat akhir dia tu Jatuh, pecah Let's just Put in that shade I don't know if I actually need the contour considering how tan I look now but Bila I dah macam letak powder dengan concealer tu macam okay sikit lah Tak adalah tan tu hmm. Okay so this is how my face looks like now Okay so I'm just gonna use the brush that's in this palette I'm gonna do my eye I'm gonna do a really simple one but I love shimmer So I'm gonna use some shimmer from this palette Love this palette, super expensive. I got this palette and I only paid 55 ringgit because I got gift cards. So yay! 
I'm just gonna really do a simple one. It's basically what I always do lah, okay? I will always take like a brown shade to go all over my eyelid. I am going to take the shade um, Dragon right here. I'm just gonna use my finger. Now for like shimmer shades, I will always use just my finger. Okay. Just do that. I'm just gonna buff it out to so blend dengan the punya brown shade tadi. Okay. So ni mata ais sekarang after aku eyeshadow. So this is usually the look that I always do. Usually I lagi suka pakai shimmers from my ColourPop punya palette, which is this one, this palette. So loved. Okay. I like this shade, as you can see. They are heat pen up there. Love this. I'm going to use the Hyper Sharp Eyeliner from Maybelline. Okay, I don't know if my eyeliner is balanced or not. Okay, like it. <sighs> I'm gonna use this blusher. This is from Wet n Wild. Um, I nak letak a bit of the eyeshadow dekat belah bawah mata I. So it looks a bit weird. I'm just gonna use whatever that's left on the brush for my nose. Because um, this is actually quite pigmented. Yeah? Ta-da! Contour the nose. We got my chumstick. I'm just gonna buff it. A bit too much. Rub it with the finger. Better. I'm just gonna take the powder on your brush and just kind of like dab on my nose. So it doesn't look too harsh. It's a bit blended. The dog. So far, so good, right? Okay Not bad. Dah lama dah tak buat makeup. I'm just gonna touch up kan I punya eyebrow sikit. I tahu orang selalu suruh draw macam half towards the back. But I always buat one line under the front part because I don't have hair. My eyebrow is very, very, very limited. If you have macam nice eyebrow, macam your eyebrows memang banyak hair, tak apa lah. Buat half and then until the end. But I would do this. Because my eyes are really good. Usually I just do this. Now use my finger to just sort of blend the edges. I don't have my eyelash color with me right now. I'm not sure where it is. So I'm just gonna go ahead and put mascara. This is the Essence mascara. This is really cheap. It's only 15 ringgit, guys. Okay, Mura. Okay, so I dah put on my mascara. I eh, tak boleh letak mascara dekat under eyes I because this is not waterproof mascara. I don't really like waterproof mascara. So, if I put under lashes yang belah bawah ni, nanti dia akan nampak macam dia akan smudge lah. So, tak cantik. So, I will just put dekat atas. Uh, unless if I want to go full on glam, then yes, I would put belah bawah and I would use a mascara that's waterproof. So, I'm not sure where my highlighter is. So, I'm just going to take from one. I'm just going to use the eyeshadow from one of the palette. Alright, so I'm just gonna use this one over here. There. And the bridge of the nose. Right there. Okay, I'm just gonna blend it out using a clean finger. Before that, I am going to macam nak bagi nampak I punya eyebrow ni lagi kemas and pop. I akan guna this shade to just like kind of outline my eyebrow. Because I don't really like carving out my eyebrow guna um concealer so but I don't really like a lot of liquid on my face and this is what I would usually do lah okay this is macam my everyday makeup routine kan macam my, my simplest go-to makeup routine 
So you just get the powder one. Okay. And now I just cover it up. It's still it will still look neat and if it doesn't look too crazy. The other side. I'm just gonna use the same brush and dip it into this shade over here. This is called Girls Bite. Girls Bite. Just highlight the inner corner of my eye. Inner corner right there. Well, girls, look at my eye. It's off. Hmm. Mm, not that skin, not too pizza. Mm. If you ever feel it, that bendy and banyak, you can just always take your powder brush and just buff it up. Oh, wait! I not tried it. I punya, um, silky girl punya lipstick too but I just remembered that the Muka and Co punya bandol ni it came with lipstick huh. I took the shade Liberal Nude hopefully it's something oh. ooh I love this kind of shade I love darker shades Good. And to top it all off, I'm going to use this setting spray. Shake, shake, shake it. I'm just gonna squeeze it. Alright, so this is the final look. To be honest, ni bukan lah everyday makeup uh, routine. I uh, the half of my half of my face is gonna be covered with face mask and sekarang. So I would just put concealer to cut uh, my forehead and the cut uh, under my eyes and then I would powder it and then I would do my eyebrows I would uh, but eyeshadow memang I buat macam ni uh, cuma usually I would use the shade from the Colourpop palette instead because I love the shade from this Colourpop better let me just swatch it for you ah look at that ain't that pretty okay another shade that I would usually use is this one this is also from the Colourpop palette. I love this. Oh my god, so pretty kan. Cantik kan. Let me just swatch one colour from the MVZ palette. <laughs> just because it's fun. I'm, take, I'm gonna take the glittery one. I'm just gonna... Walala. Oh my god, this combination is so nice. Cantik gila. So thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Because this is my first ever makeup video yang I akan post. My god. Malunya, I don't know how to feel about it. Salah buat je makeup and makeup I biasa-biasa je. Ramai je lagi orang yang buat makeup lagi cantik kan. I'm still learning. Um, I do do makeup jobs from time to time. But like I said, I'm still learning. There are so many others yang uh, better than me. Honestly, I tak regret uh, ambil medium walaupun initially it looks stand on me. Because like I see I, I punya product yang lain semua is a bit lighter. So, they kind of like balance it out. So, you, as you can see, it's not that tan now. I don't think it's tan at all because of the concealer and because of my powder. Can? 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 So, yeah. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. Mwah.